Hey everyone, welcome to my channel. Here I'm doing a question on a long division of a polynomial, and here's a question: divide x square plus seven x plus twelve by x plus four. So here we're dividing a trinomial by a binomial. So in such cases, when we cannot factorize or when we have to do it easy way, we can just go for long division. We'll get the answer. So we'll write down the dividend and divisor first. So here, dividend is x square plus seven x plus twelve, and divisor is x plus four. Now, how to do this? Now, these steps you have to remember for every step. Uh, what I am going to explain now, that is how to find out the quotient. Quotient is found by dividing the first term of the dividend by the first term of the divisor, and this we are going to do for every step. Okay, so here the first term is x square, so x square upon x. So you can cancel one one x, it will get x here. So this x is a quotient. We got first quotient here, first term of the quotient. Now second step is you have to multiply the divisor with this quotient. Now multiply both x and four with x. So x into x is x square plus four into x is four x. Don't forget to multiply with four. You should multiply one with four. After this, we have to subtract, like how we do a normal division. But you have to just be careful because signs will change here. So plus will become minus. So this is a positive, so it became negative. Even this will also become negative. From now, when you subtracting it, you have to consider the new signs, not the old one. So x square minus x square will get cancelled, and uh, x square minus four x will become three x. So write down the three x. Now drop this twelve, we'll get plus twelve. Now this is a new dividend we got three x plus twelve. Again we have to find out the quotient. So same step, take the first term of the dividend and divide with the first term of the divisor. So here we'll divide three x with x. So x and x will get cancelled. We'll get three. So write down the three in the numerator. It's a positive three, so we'll write down plus three. Now again, multiply x plus four with three. Now don't multiply with x; you have to just multiply with three. So x into three is three x, and then four into three is twelve plus twelve. Now change the signs. So here we'll get minus, and the plus will become minus. Now we can cancel both of the terms. We got remainder zero. That's it. So this is the answer here. The question to what we got is the answer, which is x plus three. So when you divide x square plus seven x plus twelve by x plus four, we'll get answer x plus three. This was the first question. Now we'll go and move on to the second question. So here I've taken a different number. So divide four y square plus three y plus one upon two by two y plus one. So we will write down this. So divisor is two y plus one, and dividend is four y square plus three y plus one upon two. Okay, so again, we will find out the first term here, first term of the question. For that, divide the first term of the dividend by the first term of the divisor. So we'll get four y square upon two y. So we can cancel two and four. We'll get two. You can cancel one one y. So we'll get this is equal to two y. So write down two y in the here in the question. Now multiply two y plus one with this two y. So two y into two y is four y square plus one into two y is two y. Now after doing it, change the signs. If you don't change the signs and you have done directly like this from here onwards, your answer will come wrong. So don't forget to change the signs. So here it was a positive, so it become negative, and this also become negative. Now cancel the new signs and solve it. We can cancel the first term. Now three y minus two y is one y, or you can just write y plus one upon two. Okay. Now we have to find out new quotient again. So for that, divide the first term of the new dividend by the first term of the divisor. So we'll get y upon two y. So cancel the y. We'll get one upon two. 
so write down that one upon two here we'll get a plus one upon two now multiply 2y plus 1 with 1 upon 2 don't multiply with 2y just multiply with 1 upon 2 so 2y into 1 upon 2 will be y plus 1 into 1 upon 2 is 1 upon 2 now subtract so change the signs it will be minus this will be minus now you can cancel the, the first term and the second term we got remainder equal to 0 so answer will be 2y plus 1 upon 2 this is what you should do for the every step find out the quotient for the each step change the sign subtract and just keep doing it now we'll go for the last problem so I've taken here uh, four terms as a dividend so the question is divide 3x cube plus 4x square plus 5x plus 18 by x plus 2 now we'll write down this So 3x cube plus 4x square plus 5x plus 18 is a dividend and divisor is x plus 2. Now first step is you have to eliminate the 3x cube. For that divide the first term of the dividend that is 3x cube by the first term of the divisor which is x. Now cancel x and x will get 3x square and this is a question now. So write down 3x square. Now multiply x plus 2 with 3x square. So we'll get here x into 3x square is 3x cube plus 2 into 3x square is 6x square. Now subtract it. So when you're subtracting, signs will change. This will be minus and even this will be minus. Cancel the first term. So 4x square minus 6x square will be minus 2x square now drop this 5x so plus 5x we got now we have to find out the new question again so first term of the new dividend is minus 2x square so minus 2 even you have to take the sign here minus 2x square upon the first term of divisor is x Cancel x and x will get minus 2x. So write down that minus 2x in the quotient. Okay. Now multiply. Multiply x plus 2 with minus 2x. Consider the sign also here. So x into minus 2x is minus 2x square. And then 2 into minus 2x is minus 4x. Now signs will change. Minus will become plus. And here also it become plus. Now consider the new signs here. So minus 2x square plus 2x will get cancelled. 5x plus 4x is 9x. Now drop this 18. Plus 18. Now again you have to find out the quotient here. And the new dividend we got here is 9x plus 18. And the first term is 9x. So divide the 9x with the first term of the divisor which is x. Cancel x and x will get answer 9. And this is your new quotient. So write down plus 9. Now multiply x plus 2 with 9. Okay, so x into 9 is 9x plus 2 9s are 18. Change the signs. It become minus. Even this will become minus. Cancel up. You will get answer equal to 0. That is remainder is equal to 0. So from here the question we got here is 3x square minus 2x plus 9 that's it so this is what this is what we'll do in a long division i hope you have understood this if you have any question or doubt you can just leave a comment below and thank you so much for watching this if you like this video then subscribe and click on bell icon